In recent years, the global defense industry has witnessed significant advancements in electronic warfare systems. These systems are crucial for modern militaries, enabling them to detect, analyze, and counter enemy radar and missile threats. One such development is the testing of Turkey's indigenous EdPod tactical electronic support pod, which marks a major milestone in the country's defense capabilities. Turkey has long been a key player in NATO's southern flank, with its strategic location bridging Europe and the Middle East. The Turkish Air Force plays a critical role in maintaining regional stability and the back of its fleet consists of Lockheed Martin F-16 Fighting Falcons. These multi-role fighter jets have been in service since the 1980s and have undergone numerous upgrades to keep pace with evolving threats. The F-16 Block 40 variant, specifically, is known for its advanced avionics and versatility. It is equipped with systems designed for precision strikes, reconnaissance missions, and electronic warfare. Over the years, Turkey has invested heavily in modernizing its F-16 fleet, ensuring that these aircraft remain effective on the battlefield. However, the reliance on foreign suppliers for critical components like electronic warfare pods has been a challenge one that Turkey aims to address with the development of the EdPod system so what exactly is the EdPod tactical electronic support pod officially designated as EdPod this is a state-of-the-art electronic warfare pod developed indigenously by Turkey designed to be integrated into various combat platforms including the F-16 the EdPod serves multiple purposes the pod can identify and detect threat radar systems and missiles providing real-time situational awareness to pilots it uses advanced algorithms to pinpoint the geographic location of enemy emitters, allowing for precise targeting the EdPod system extracts and records data from intercepted signals, which can later be analyzed to enhance operational intelligence. These capabilities make the EdPod an invaluable asset in modern warfare, where electronic dominance often determines the outcome of engagements. By developing this system domestically, Turkey reduces its dependence on foreign suppliers and strengthens its defense industrial base. The successful testing of the EdPod aboard a Turkish Air Force F-16 Block 40 represents a significant technical achievement. According According to reports, the testing process involved rigorous evaluations to ensure the pod's compatibility with the aircraft and its ability to perform under realistic combat scenarios. Key aspects of the testing is ensuring seamless integration between the EdPod and the F-16 avionics suite assessing the pod's ability to detect and locate radar threats accurately simulating real-world conditions to validate the pod's effectiveness in dynamic environments. This comprehensive approach mirrors similar efforts seen in other countries, such as the United States combined operational and developmental testing programs for next-generation technologies. The success of these trials demonstrates Turkey's growing expertise in developing and deploying advanced defense systems. The introduction of the EdPod aligns with Turkey's broader strategy of achieving self-sufficiency in defense production. Over the past decade, Ankara has prioritized the development of indigenous systems to reduce reliance on Western suppliers, many of whom have imposed restrictions due to political tensions by equipping its F-16 fleet with the EdPod. Turkey enhances its ability to conduct independent operations while contributing more effective to NATO missions. Additionally, the pod's capabilities bolster Turkey's deterrence posture against potential adversaries in the region, particularly those equipped with sophisticated air defense networks. Moreover, the successful testing of the EdPod pod underscores Turkey's commitment to innovation and technological advancement. This achievement not only boosts national pride but also positions Turkey as a leader in the global defense industry to fully appreciate the significance of the EdPod. We must consider the broader geopolitical context. Turkey faces complex security challenges, ranging from conflicts in neighboring Syria and Iraq to tensions with Greece over maritime boundaries in the eastern Mediterranean. In this volatile environment, maintaining a robust air force is essential for safeguarding national interests. The EdPod provides Turkey with a significant edge in electronic warfare, enabling it to neutralize enemy air defenses and protect its forces during operations. This capability could prove decisive in future confrontations, especially given the increasing proliferation of advanced radar and missile systems in the region. Furthermore, the development of indigenous systems like the EdPod reflects Turkey's desire to assert greater autonomy in its foreign policy. By reducing dependence on external partners, Ankara seeks to pursue its strategic objectives without being constrained by international sanctions or export controls. In conclusion, the successful testing of the EdPod tactical electronic support pod aboard a Turkish Air Force F-16 Block 40 marks a pivotal moment in Turkey's defense modernization journey. This achievement highlights the country's growing technological prowess and its determination to achieve self-reliance in critical military domains as Turkey continues to develop and deploy advanced systems like the EdPod it reinforces its position as a formidable regional power and a valuable ally within NATO. Looking ahead, the integration of the EdPod into the Turkey's Air Force operational doctrine promises to enhance Turkey's combat readiness and contribute to regional stability. Thank you for watching. If you found this video informative, please like, share, and subscribe for more content on defense and technology. Let us know in the comments what you think about Turkey's progress in electronic warfare systems.